There are many, many people who always tell you, live below your means. Well, that's not a rich dad philosophy either. Because I think if you live below your means, and if you, especially if you're poor already, you live below the means, your spirit dies. So what the rich dad company is really about is how do you improve your spirit by increasing your financial intelligence or your financial IQ. Instead of living below my means, or what most people have as a J-O-B, a job, you can only work so hard. So my goal, my wife's goal every single year, is we increase our assets. So we buy more rental property, we invest in oil, gold, stocks that pay dividends and all this. So every year, our income or our cash flow keeps increasing every year. Our goal is not to get a higher paying job. Our, our goal is to keep inc increasing our assets. Now, another thing, too, is people say, but, but you know, what about the nice cars and all that? The way I get rich is this. I buy assets first, liability second. Let me give you an example. A few years ago, I wanted a new Porsche. So let's say this is the Porsche here. My wife says, you can have that Porsche. It's a liability. But you can have it as long as I first invest in an asset. So this was a long time ago. My, I invested a few thousand dollars in a mini storage in Austin, Texas. And every month, the money from that investment comes in, and it paid off my Porsche. So today, I don't have any debt for my Porsche. I still have my Porsche. I still have it all this time. I still have the investment, and I still have my cash flow. So that's one of the differences between don't live below your means. I, we used to say, what we say at Rich does increase your means, and you can have anything you like. We want you to have all the wonderful things this world has to offer, and that's what makes the Rich Dad Company's philosophy a little different than the rest.